Greetings, everyone. This is Jim Todd with Song Surgeon, and I have another sneak peek preview at version 5. And today I thought I would just show you the submenu for the algorithm. So you will recall in version 4, we had both a P or a T. P for performance, T for transcribe. We have those two in version 5, but we also have a third one, which is for voice. So if you are translating something or you're learning a new language or you recorded a lecture at a seminar and you need to or would like to speed it up or slow it down or whatever, this will give you a better quality um, audio from changing key or changing tempo with voice only types of audio files. Um, Transcribe is a special setting that we had last time and really there's not a lot probably that you need to do with this because it's geared toward those situations when you're making very significant changes in key or tempo. For instance, primarily I would think people use this if they're slowing something down to learn a new song and they're slowing it down to 50% or 30% or alternatively maybe they're speeding it up because they have someone who speaks very slowly and they would like to speed up the tempo because they're transcribing it and they want to be able to hear and get through the entire recording much quicker. But the one that I think you're gonna see the most difference with is P for performance. Now, previously in version four, we had performance, uh, a performance algorithm just like this. And the settings underneath the hood that you did not see last time were a lambda value of preview and a quality value of best. And with these settings, we received many emails uh, from people who would tell us that the quality of the audio after key or tempo change is excellent. In fact, they told us that it's better than programs like Cubase or Sound Tools, and those are high quality recording and editing software programs used by the pros. Um, and these programs cost hundreds and in some cases thousands of dollars. So we achieve the quality that we have in version four with this performance setting with Lambda set at its lowest value. So in this version five, you're going to be able to increase the value from preview to L1, L2, L3, L4, and L5. And as you do that, you're going to get better quality each time. So if you thought the quality was good last time, this is even going to be better, if you can believe that. The only caveat here is that some of these settings take such large amounts of CPU that when you try to preview them, that is when you try to play back and listen, you're going to have problems doing it with many machines because they're just not going to have the CPU power necessary. Um, so previewing it might cause a problem. You're going to hear some starting and stopping perhaps, but that really doesn't matter in a sense because you can still export, create a new file with these settings and the new file will play back perfectly because all the work has been done in the processing. Once the processing is done and the file is created, then it will play back with these settings applied and will give you the highest quality here that you can get. So if you're looking for something that's even higher quality than what we have, you're going to be able to do that with this performance setting by simply adjusting these lambda values and increasing it to the highest value that you can possibly get. So stay tuned to this newsletter and look for more of these sneak peek videos in the near future. Thanks for watching.